Have you ever streamed or recorded a video and then you realize that your microphone was muted the entire time? Well, with this new OBS plugin, that won't be an issue anymore. I'll show you how to set it up and install it. So without further ado, let's hop right into it. This OBS plugin is called Mute Notification and it does exactly what it's named. It sends the notification as soon as your microphone is muted so you can know when to unmute it and actually talk. So I'll show you how to install it. It takes like two seconds. It's really simple, nothing complicated. You just go to this website that will be linked down in the description below. Once you're right there, you go to the download button and it will open up another website where you can actually install the plugin. So what I usually do is I download the zip, but you can download the installer if you're on the Windows. It's much simpler. You just run next, next, next. That's basically it. If you have the zip file, you copy the files into your OBS destination, which is usually C program files and then OBS studio. You just paste them in and that's it. Now, let me show you how to actually use the plugin. So now that my OBS is opened up, all I want to do is find the audio mixer, which is on the side right here, and then find the microphone, which is mic aux for me. For you, it might be named something else. You right click it, you go into filters, and then you add a new filter called muted notification right over here. You click OK, that's totally fine. And that's basically it. You don't really need to change much. There's uh, the noise gate where, you know, it will find what's your voice and what's not your voice. If you're using noise gate, this can be helpful. You can just play around with these settings, close threshold, open threshold, basically what amount of decibels will have your microphone opened up and which amount will have it closed. So if you have a lot of background noise, that might trigger the muted notification. And if you talk louder than this or somewhere in between, that will actually trigger it properly. So play around with these if there's a lot of noise in your background, but that's basically it. You add the visual indicator if you really want to, which will show up on the screen. But the most important thing that you want to do is add the audio indicator, which right here, you just hit, click on enabled, and then you just choose your output device, whatever you want, your speakers, your headphones, whatever you're using. I'm using my headphones, so this is system right here. I click on system. The usual audio file for when you're muted is pretty good, but if you want to change it, you can just click browse and then add whatever else you want. And now how can we test it out? We just click on close, we mute our microphone, and then I can speak and then it will do the ticking sound. And then there will also be this uh, red dot on top left that will make sure to let me know that I am indeed muted. So it's a really simple plugin, but it does get the job done and it's amazing. And that's basically it. I know how much of an issue this is and how many people have recorded and streamed for a very long time without knowing their microphone was muted. So this will solve your issue. If you did like this video, make sure to drop a like. It would mean the world. If you don't already know, I do stream on Twitch three days a week. Link is down in the description below. If you want to see more of my OBS guides, make sure to check this video right over here. Anyway, I'll see you in the next one. Peace out and have a good one. Bye-bye.